Ian. Pat. So we had a trailer come out that didn't break the internet. No, but it, it broke me. It broke you? In a good way. It, it was the, shattered me. The Pikachu Detective. Detective Pikachu trailer. So uh, the tech, the, it's it's barely even a teaser. That thing was that thing rolled deep. Um, so, yes, uh, Detective Pikachu was a movie that was uh, rumored in the works for quite some time. It was a game announcement in a rumored movie. Uh, might have been more than a rumor. I mean, it was talked about, but I don't think anyone really expected it to happen. And then out of nowhere, they dropped the trailer for it. It's a live action movie. And uh, it's a live action, real humans location. <laughs> real humans. Real humans. Not those fake ones. But uh, fake Pokemon. Um, CGI Pokemon. And um, it's, it's the first thing before we go any further is, is the look. Um, it's, in my opinion, the look of the CG Pokemon in the real world. Um, well, first of it, all, it's, it's like a futuristic looking city, right? It looks like a, like a, some sort of like post, like not, not, I mean, it's not super futuristic. It's just modern looking. It's, sure. Super modern city though. Like a Japanese sort of state of the art city. Sure. It's like, yes. Um, and I mean, it looks like Asia, but I don't know. It's, and, and the Pokemon themselves are somewhere caught between uh, adorable and terrifying looking. Um, I don't know. It's like this weird, perfect in-between of just cute enough to not be terrifying. Um, Ryan Reynolds is doing the voice of uh, Detective Pikachu. Um, so a lot of people are already saying, hey, all they can hear is Deadpool. Yeah, um, that's probably unfortunate. People were pushing for Danny DeVito. And I and that probably would have been the 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 cult choice, but obviously for popularity, the kids, most of the kids, will say like, "Who the hell's Danny DeVito?" Even though he's been great on on uh, it's always sunny in Philadelphia the past fucking fourteen years, he's been on that show. Now, holy shit, I love forever. I love Danny DeVito, but everyone does um, national but, treasure. And I'll watch my words carefully here. But everyone who was upset about Danny DeVito not getting chosen, he was never in the running. It was just something that people wanted. And yes, he would have made a good voice for it. But I think Ryan Reynolds will do just fine. Yeah, I think people wanted more of a gruff, hard edge sounding detective versus you know like sarcastic I, I, I think, Ryan Reynolds I think sarcasm was going to be there regardless I, 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 my only guess is A. Ryan Reynolds is popular of course but B. maybe they didn't want Pikachu to sound so old maybe they wanted him to sound somewhat youngish I have no idea um, but in, in terms of that it looks like it's a uh, a suitably weird. Uh, it looks bizarre. The movie. It looks insane. It's, it has. <laughs> it's, uh, it's, it's a poke uh, noir. Like what the fuck is it? It's almost like how they just had that um, the adult uh, Muppet movie come out that was gritty and dark and had to do with the murder. Oh yeah. It's like it's kind of the different tone that we were expecting. Yeah. Muppet <laughs> sex and I'm not saying it's going to be Pokemon sex, but the fact that. You know, you have. I think now is the time to talk about tasteful sex scenes in Pokemon movies. This is well, this is where we're gonna break new ground. Well, you had like weird lounge singer looking. Uh, what was it? Was it Squirtle? The one that people were complaining about. Which was the one? No, oh, uh, the one with the, the hair. People were saying that they shouldn't have hair. I don't know anything about Pokemon, by the way. I I know nothing. Uh, Jigglypuff. Jigglypuff. Oh, Jigglypuff. Has hair. J it was Jigglypuff. Oh, they, they don't want it to be fuzzy. That's what it was. People were like, well, why is it's it fuzz? A, it's well, a puff. I mean, it's it, but it, it is labeled a balloon Pokemon. Well, what's going on here? You have uh, the actor Justice Smith, who's now in everything, by the way. Right. Uh, I I keep thinking he's been around for like eight years, just because he was in uh, what is it the the, the one about hip hop in the in the seventies in New York. He was on that Netflix show. He starred in that. Oh he's just, right. He was in Jurassic uh, Jurassic World two. Um, he's been in everything recently, and he stars in this. And he can he's the only one that can understand Pikachu. Pikachu. Yep. Uh, to everyone else, it's a Pika Pika. Right. And they're like, what's going on? So there's something to that. I'm not sure that, that that's built into the story. But um, I don't know. What do, you, what do you think? Where do you think this could... Do you think this is going to just... People are going to see this out of morbid curiosity? Even I, if they're I, not I, Pokemon there, there, are, there are people who, uh, who are very... Ex there's a camp that's very excited to see this. That would be my camp. Um, and then I think, I think there are people who are going to go see it just to see it. Just, just to see, like, what to, the hell's going on. Just to be on. like, what the hell is this? Um, this is a very weird gamble, and I think it will pay off for them. Well, I don't think it's going to do. 
I don't think it's gonna. What are your choices? You do a you do like a, uh, a computer animated movie like Wreck It Ralph or a Pixar where it's just a Pokemon movie. Yeah, and, and you don't gonna... and you take no chances and you probably make you make money. You make money, and if this goes poorly, you probably will end up making the same amount of money, or you surprise yourself. Either way, this is the more interesting thing to do with the property. Sure, because I wouldn't see a regular Pokemon right. movie. I will see this. Exactly. This gets someone like me like interested. Like this looks like a weird. If like if I if I didn't know that Pokemon were a thing and I saw this, I would be interested just because these characters are weird and wacky, and it's so off kilter. Yeah. It's like again, it's like the Muppet movie with like sex and violence. It's it, it it's just disturbing. It's it's a it's diametrically opposed, but it's interesting. Because yeah. Even if you don't know what Pokemon is, because this is not, you know, this is not. Pokemon movie 8 Detective Pikachu. It's just Detective Pikachu. You can look at this and go, well, this is odd. This is interesting. So, okay. Yeah, oh, it was a get down. That was a series. I don't know That's if you saw it, that yeah. Netflix. Yep. Surprised I didn't get a get a sequel series. It was very good or, or a, a follow-up uh, season. The kid's only 23. He's been in everything already. Good for him. Good for him. I thought I saw I thought he was in like Walking Dead years back and got killed. But that was either him or someone that looked like him. Like four years ago, when the show was still watchable, uh, that's a whole other conversation. Where Walking Dead's gone, holy crap! Has that fallen off a cliff? Oh, now, I've heard now it's, it's like now it's just homework yeah. to watch. You have uh, they they fast forwarded in time twice. Spoilers. Now that we're talking about Walking Dead, they fast forwarded like a year at the beginning of the season. Then after Rick Grimes just left, um, they fast forward like five six years. So the daughter is now basically Annie Oakley. She's like six years old, and she's like shooting guns, and she acts like an adult. The writing's horrible. Like it's like the worst thing they, they could have possibly done. Oh, all right, good. It, it's like it's like the Wesley Crusher on steroids in terms of this kid is should not be this <laughs> clued into everything. <laughs> Talking to Negan to get homework help, it's awful. Anyway, so we went off on the, on a tangent here. So uh, when does this come out, Ian? At uh, twenty nineteen, sometime I don't know. When. Detective Pikachu. Release date. Uh, we got May tenth. Oh, right after, right after someone's uh, birthday. There, we take, take oh, it to my birthday right. to see it. All okay, right. all right, okay. 